The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says sugary diets are leading to more cases of obesity, type 2 diabetes, and heart disease. So we're going to show you how to hunt for hidden sugars with Mayo Clinic dietitian Kate Saratsky. You probably wouldn't pour sugar on a burger, but you're getting it with nearly every squirt of ketchup. One tablespoon of ketchup actually has one teaspoon of sugar in it. Sweeteners could be hiding in a lot of the condiments, sauces, and dressings in your refrigerator. They're what dietitians call hidden or added sugars. Sugars that are added to food simply provide a sweetness to that food, and they're also used in preserving it. Added sugars come in many forms and names, including corn syrup, honey, and a host of terms that end in os. Each gram of sugar is four calories, and four grams of sugar is equal to one teaspoon. Kate says the average person has about 18 teaspoons of added sugars each day. That's about 300 empty calories. So what's the problem with added sugars? They provide sweetness and additional calories without contributing to essential nutrients. That's why the American Heart Association recommends limiting the amount of added sugars to no more than a few teaspoons a day. So for teens and adult women, that's about six teaspoons of sugar or about 100 calories. For adult men, that's about nine teaspoons or about 150 calories per day. You have to read labels. Specifically, look at ingredient lists. This will help you make smarter choices. Be on the lookout for hidden sugars in yogurt, snack bars, juices, and packed fruits. Before we move on, a point about natural sugars found in fruit and milk products. They're different from added sugars because they are naturally occurring and are part of a food that offers nutrients along with calories. Natural sugars can be part of a healthy diet. 